This episode of Live Tech Australia is brought to you by the Ox Digital Pocket Radio. The brand new folio from HP is one of its latest ultrabooks for holiday season. Competing directly in the face of the MacBook Air, it features a 128GB solid-state hard drive, 4GB of RAM, and an Intel HD graphics chip. It also features a second-generation Intel Core i5 1.6GHz processor, which means it's very snappy. On the left side of the laptop, you can see we have the power input, an Ethernet port, an HDMI input, a USB 3.0 input, and an SD card slot. On the right side of the notebook, we have a USB 2.0 input and a headphone input. The Ultrabook also has a Windows Experience rating of 4.7, which we thought was quite disappointing for a notebook of this stature. Let's check in and see a bit more into depth about the Windows Experience rating. The processor was decent, coming in with a subscore of 6.3. The RAM came in at 7.2, and the graphics at a 4.7. The gaming graphics, on the other hand, actually came out at 6.2, which is more than we expected. And the primary hard disks, winning all of the subscores, came out at a whopping 7.4. Obviously, we know this is not a gaming laptop but we thought it would be interesting to try some games out on it. We tested out a 3D game and it wasn't so bad. The graphics were not terrible at all and there was no sign of lagging whatsoever. As we bumped up to games with more serious 3D graphics, this is where the Ultrabook started lacking in performance. Obviously, like we said, it's not a gaming laptop, it's a prosumer laptop uh, for the average businessman to check his emails, do a couple of spreadsheets, Word documents, and even surf the web. We definitely think that this is quite a good laptop for the average prosumer businessman. It does come in at a bit of a pricey range at just under one and a half grand, which is quite expensive. But if you're on the PC side and you're in that sort of ecosystem and you really don't want to get a MacBook Air, this is the perfect alternative. Uh, it's pretty much, pretty much the same, uh, sleek, has solid state hard drive and it is very fast. So they share very similar qualities. If you are on the PC side, I definitely would have a look into this for the holiday season. Anyway guys, that's it for this episode. I've been Daniel for Live Tech Australia. You can check out all our social links in the description below. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, it's all there. So remember to subscribe for more awesome videos and we will see you guys later in the next video.